Look at the Machatu. The buses, public means of transport. We call them Ganya in this city. the city to a market center so we have people doing hawking here what we call vending uh, you know english depends with whether you you school the american english or the, uh, the british english so which one did you school we call it hawking here then my tattoos to some the public transport vehicles to our country so my name is going to africa my travel and a youtuber from kenya africa so I'm in the famous River Road. Yeah, it's River Road. If you want to pick a vehicle to Mombasa or to the coastal town, this is where we pick them from. Very busy street. Yeah, I love Nairobi evening. I'm part of calling Nairobi. Nairobi. Some people have been correcting me. You should not call it. Nairobi, it's Nairobi. See, it depends with the school you attended. Some high-end skyscrapers here. So we are stuck in a traffic jump. Just go to the city. A very beautiful city, though very chaotic. This is Nairobi downtown. It's never that secure when you are in downtown. Wow, amazing. You know, I keep on subscribing to this channel. Check me 10,000 subs. That's some guys, uh, they're the motorbike riders. Call them the border border. That's a very common business in this city. The means of transport here is either the Matatu, the Nganya, which is the most common public means of transport. Then we have the Ndudi system, the motorbike, then the cars of course, and our train. Very beautiful city. So these are the kind of Matatu heading to up country, the 14 seater Matatu. Oh, they're charging how much? 500 to Nakuru. Nakuru is one of the counties of this country. I'll be showing the beauty of this city today. I hope you're going to enjoy the video. Like and share the link with your friends. So that's a club. Upstairs. Nairobi! So basically, in Kenya, we compete to board the Matatu with the best graffiti, the most music, the best, the most luxury, and of course, they charge more. Amazing. 
Τυρίζον Τι λανάδα γραφίτσι Νουκούκα μόλια We pack the Gaflani up on Bailey up on Different companies will compete on the Camel to have the best graffiti yeah. Mind your own business warning oh, yes. That's a good one That's a good one, so I'm going to a live in time from now When you hear Sony Moza, that means 100. It's one dollar. So different items here will have different costs. This is the capital city of Kenya, Nairobi. Nairobi comes from the town. Enkare Nairobi, Masai word, which means place of cold waters. So when you ask someone, where are the waters? We can't see waters. Initially, this place was a swamp. Then we have someone who thinks it's called um, Nairobi, a place of quarters because of Nairobi River. So it will depend on who introduced you to the city and which book did you study? What were their interests, of course? <laughs> it's a Samgolia. mistake you can never make when crossing the road is doing it simply because someone else did it you think twice all the time make sure you make the right decision so now I just join uptown for your safety when you are in uptown it's more recommended more advisable
Damn, look at that Ganya. The Matatu. Looks good, right? Another one here. I think the beauty of this city always makes me not to make decisions on leaving this country. That is it. Not leaving permanent, but I would like to tour the world. So the goal of this channel is to showcase Africa to the world and to show the world to Africa. Here we have one of the freedom fighters. Let me show you. I want to be, be getting inside. I don't know whether I'm able to open it. Yeah, yeah. Just opened it. I don't know whether they allow or not, but just did it. The guy was Kimadi Washuri. This statue is dedicated to Dana Kimadi Washuri. He was born in the year 1920, then died in the year 1957. Very young guy, at the age of 15, 38. Gallant soldier, Mama Freedom Fighter. So today is Eros Day. A day whereby we're celebrating those guys who fought for our freedom. They fought for our independence. So these are the guys who fight, the, who fought the colonial government. Then we have some very careless people stoning the area. Stoning the statue. When you're demonstrating, this guy never did nothing wrong to you. In fact, you should be participating on cleaning the area. Yeah, this is someone who fought for your freedom. You need to respect this. Whether you do, you're fighting for your right or not, we really don't care, but you have to respect such. Class of people here are changing. We have no hawkers, unlike what you witnessed in downtown. So I chose to walk in between the street to give you a better view of the same. Most business around this place are international. Either banks, uh, insurance companies, and uh, what you calling the bureau of exchange. Bureau of exchange is forex. Yeah, forex business. Aristo Coffee. I'm not advertising no one. Just showing you what is good. So when we see something good, we have to say. So just join me. My name is Gosi Africa. I'm a travel and a YouTuber from Kenya, Africa. Kindly subscribe. And welcome to the green city below the sun, Nairobi City. So far, Nairobi is the most popular city we have in Africa. So when you are mentioning Johannesburg in South Africa or Pretoria, Nairobi law is stand out. A very clean city as well, though I believe Kigali is more clean than what you can see around. Kigali is the capital city of Rwanda. Their president is a Pan African, of course. I hate to mention that country. I love that country. I love. What is this name? Someone mentioned his name. Kagame. So once you are in Uptown, you notice that people are driving bigger vehicles than 
other sides of the city than downtown. So that's another street. They call it the Wabera. We have had a long weekend in Kenya. Yo. Now that on we are Saturday, Sunday, then on Monday we're celebrating Hero's Day. This the same weekend we were hosting some big artists, some big musicians, international musicians. So Kenyans have had a very good weekend. A very beautiful weekend. That guy, instead of driving light, just uh, checked li right and left. I'm noticing that no one was observing. I know no car was coming, he decided to cross. Look at the beautiful skyscrapers around. Let me take you around. Look, just come in. Then some loud music from the Matatu. Then across we have Bank of India. Yeah, that's an international business within Kenya, within Nairobi. The capital of Kenya. Woo! Let me have a conversation with Kenyans. For the first time, I'm doing this. I started my YouTube channel a year ago. It has done so well internationally. Unfortunately, I don't have support from my country. Now, Kenyans. I know, I might be doing well out there. I might be having the right support out there, but I don't have the support of my fellow Kenyans. It feels good when you're going out there and behind you, you know that you have a good backup. You have the right support from your people. Anytime I'm having premium, you guys are Clocking on my channel and commenting, whether in Swahili, whether on my in my mother tongue or in English, it's either you don't support your own, or I never did proper marketing in my country. But still, I never did proper marketing in the other countries. Lucky, I had connection with some big YouTubers, African tigers. I so much appreciate you. So she introduced me to her audience in the Caribbean and I started doing well in the Caribbean. So now, I'm back to you, Kenyans. Yeah, you know, you are my people. Whether I'm really, um, whether I'm a superstar or not, I really need to have a backup of my people. Now I request you, I'm your own. My name is Tosh, I'm the founder of Go See Africa. So the goal is always to showcase Africa, so that's, what my channel focuses with. Now I kindly request you to subscribe to my channel, share the link, and please don't turn to watch my content. Anytime you see me upload a video, kindly watch it from the start to the end and don't jump the adverts. Those ads pay us. I know people think that we, are get, we get paid by the views, but that's not, not the reality. The reality is we get paid with the ads. Please don't skip them. Watch them. That's the best way to promote me. I will never request you for any, uh, any other kind of support. Apart from subscription, which is free, and watching the ads. So kindly Kenyans. I know it might take time for you to understand what I do, but I showcase the beauty of your country and Africa at large. So kindly go ahead and subscribe. This is the famous Kenyatta Avenue, 
which is named after the first president of Kenya, the founding father of Kenya. Then we have the coat of arms there. Where we have Nairobi City County. Yeah, that's the coat of arms. This is one of the famous avenues we have in the country. And one of the biggest avenues we have in the country. A very supportive governor of this county. I say, I say that nobody paid me to promote them. But the guy is a content creator and he's doing well for his fellow content creators. So he allowed us to film freely. Before you couldn't film freely, someone will ask you, why are you filming in the city? Do you have a license? Do you have authorization? So someone will try to extort money from you. Lately, we don't have that. I'm loving my country. So slowly, we are adopting democracy. We are having the right to express ourselves and do anything that we wish, so long as it doesn't hurt anyone. If you want to go fast, go along. If you want to go far, go together. If you really understand that, you will know the need as to why I need to bow down to Kenyans and fellow Africans to support me on my journey to promoting Africa to the world showcasing Africa to the world. This is Nairobi. The green city below the sun. Very beautiful. Yeah. Do you love what you see around? It's about sunset and I need to leave the city. Nairobi, we no longer have an active nightlife as you used to have some years ago before COVID. So we might be having a very active city, but the party life changed. We used to party a lot. So we have some clubs, some big clubs which closed, closed. Yeah, they shut down. The likes of Tribeca, whoever has been to. Tribeca. I don't know whether Florida 2000 is still in operation but the popularity is still the same maybe we only change the trend the way of doing things instead of going to clubs maybe we go to restaurants we go to others we do, to, we do other businesses meanwhile the day has just ended And everyone is busy heading home. We are flying there. So everyone now is going either to pick their vehicle or heading to various matter to yeah, stages. To various matter to terminals to pick their matter to back home. Basically, this is Nairobi nightlife. The very sober city has turned to a market center. Hawkers are busy in the city and no one to regulate them. So now, they do as they wish. We have other teams still here for dates.
so you will either be here for business or blog like me or you here for dates you here for meetings I'm trying to give you a sneak peek of Nairobi nightlife. <laughs> Look at the matatu. The buses, public means of transport. We call them Ghana in this city. I'll be ending the video here. So if you not subscribed to my channel, kindly go ahead and subscribe. My name is Go See Africa. I'm a traveler and a YouTuber from Kenya, Africa.